Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Joey Biagas and I'm a digital media expert. And today I'm gonna show you how to use an external hard drive for iTunes. So let's go ahead and hop onto the computer here. And I have iTunes open. Now what you wanna do is you want to go to iTunes in the top corner, click on that, go down to preferences. Okay, and you wanna make sure you're on the advanced tab here, okay? And uh, before I kind of set this up and show you guys, um, one thing to keep in mind is if you want to use an external hard drive, you're going to have to obviously have an external hard drive. So make sure you have that and that's plugged into your good old computer. Okay. All right. Let's hop back into iTunes here. Now, this is where the uh, media folder is going to be. So under volumes, Joy Biagas, iTunes, iTunes media. Now on your computer may be a little bit different. So we can change this and put the location of our iTunes media onto an external hard drive um, because most cases external hard drives have more space for us to keep our data or keep our media. And that way uh, it doesn't take up so much room and so much space on our computer's hard drive. So let's go ahead and change that. And I'm going to change that by using or clicking change. Okay, so just locate your hard drive. I'm gonna locate mine. And then I have my iTunes folder here. So you can make an iTunes folder. And then another folder here, iTunes Media. And that's it, that's all I need to do. And then iTunes will do the rest. It will make all of the other uh, folders here. So you don't have to worry too much about that. And then I'm just gonna hit open. Okay, and then we just hit okay at the bottom. And that's pretty much it. That, now you've changed your location for iTunes to keep all of its data. Um, that way it doesn't clog up all of the storage space on your computer's hard drive. So there you guys go. If you do have any other questions, please let us know. But thank you for watching.